promised us an agreeable day for football and that's exactly what we've got I'm Derek Ray and ready with his tactics board alongside me is Stuart Robson my commentary partner and with the game just moments away now this really ought to be a superb watch it's Benfica facing Celta Vigo well Derek we can talk about coaches and their methods but it's now down to the players which ones are going to stand out who will affect the game and who will have the greater desire it should be a cracking game though And they kick off here. And this is how the starting 11 looks for Benfica. David Neres starts with Angel Di Maria on the flanks. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. Rafa. Absolutely nothing wrong with the idea, but no end product. Joao Mario. And he could really get at the opposition. Great opportunity. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. Mingesa. Kevin. Cross into the penalty area. Not really the ideal clearance. Well, they can keep possession of it now. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Stuart. What do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, Derek, when he's on form, when he's focused, he's a brilliant player. Oh, manager. Stuart, an opportunity! Can they stop it going in? Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Sanchez Jürgen Strand Larsen nicely timed tackle that's a good looking ball he'll be breathing a sigh of relief ball one Neres a goal on the back of sustained pressure. Now they deservedly hold the advantage. Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. So underway again here, one nil the score. Genatore. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. Well, he's gone back and awarded the free kick because there really wasn't much of a tangible advantage. Well, he's gone into the book. Well, he was late and he deserved a booking for that. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. Well, dealt with that ball comfortably. Surely the equaliser. Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. Di Maria. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Rafa. 
a stellar piece of defending. What was the chance they could get caught out on the break here? This could be troublesome. And snuffed out the danger immediately. It needs an accurate cross. Can't miss, surely. Oh, such an elegant finish. How about that on the volley? A brilliant strike, whatever way you look at it. Well, as you can see, he gets everything right here. What a skillful volley that is. So in business once more, on the back of that very important equaliser, 1-1. David Neres. Frederic Aursnes. Joao Mario. And moving the ball forward with genuine purpose here. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Good high press. And the pass deftly cut out. David Neres. Frederick Aursnes. Ball back with Celta now. Bamba. And can he find someone at the far post? And nobody applying pressure. It should be. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And the flag is up. Offside. Well, that's just a lack of awareness. He was clearly in an offside position. Rafa. Rafa. Still could be dangerous. And a strong glove on the ball from the keeper. Fran Beltran. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. And so it is, the first half story has been written. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, they weren't at their best, but with that equaliser, you can see why he's so important to this team. Hopefully they can get more of the ball to him in the second half so he can show us his ability. Underway then in the second half. And the two teams matching each other just about stride for stride. Bamba. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Well, they might be able to launch a counter-attack. They need to get bodies back. Well, the supporters think it's on. Oh, surely! And nearly the perfect break, but no end product. Well, it's just off target, but what a good counter-attack that was. De La Torre. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Interception to snuff out the danger. Joao Mario. Chance maybe to use the counter-attacking ability to good effect. 
Well, terrific defending to stop them progressing. Jürgen Strand Larsen. That's really good and effective physical play. Bamba. Oh, managing to beat him. Intercepting it intelligently. Space on the flank. Joao Mario. Bar. Disappointing cross and gobbled up by the keeper. Could be dangerous. Well, now in a dangerous position. A magnificent stop. Well, it should be a goal, but take nothing away from the keeper. That's a brilliant save. Elects to go short. Iago Aspas. Tapia. A foul, but advantage played. The cut back. Crossing opportunity. Really good build up, but no end product. Well, maybe a good position from which to counter. Cuts it back. And you've just witnessed a moment of truly high-class goalkeeping. You're absolutely right. What a save that is. He's reacted so quickly. But he's gone short with it. Silva. Joao Mario. Well, how close was that? Inches away. Well, the stats back up what we've seen so far. Some good attacking football, chances for both teams, and plenty to enjoy. Let's hope for more of the same. And Celta have it back now. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Now can they counter clinically? Using his physique to shield the ball and then wait for others to get there. And strong play here. Crossing possibilities. Now just the tackle that was needed. Now the ball goes out of play for what will be a goal kick. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Just ten minutes remaining here. Well, you can see how fiercely they're concentrating on finding a winner. Textbook defending inside the box. Well, these fans are pushing their team on here. They sense a winner's coming. And playing it back. And a goal! At this stage of the game, it might be decisive. And just look at their supporters. Well, as you can see here, a lot of credit has to go to Di Maria. He picks up exactly the right pass, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal.
Well, the dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Well, it's almost over, but not quite. The fans still with a bit of nail-biting to do, Stuart. Well, they should have had this wrapped up long ago. Some of their football has been excellent, but they're going to need to be resilient in these final few minutes to get their much-deserved victory. This could be the equaliser, but no! When your goalkeeper comes up with a save like that late in the game, you have cause to be thankful. Well, that could be a key moment. They have to take those sort of chances. They won't get too many more, but let's credit the goalkeeper. Well, this late corner could represent the last chance to equalise. Oh, great header. Smart stop, though. The corner kicks keep on coming. Over it comes. Well, in fairness, it wasn't the best of headers. Kukchu. And with it, Joao Mario. And there goes the final whistle. And the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome. Yes, Derek, sometimes it takes a while to eventually get the better of the opposition, and that was the case here. They kept going, and they eventually got their reward. Well, no wonder the cameras are affixed to Rafa, the sort of performance we've come to expect from him. What did you make of his contribution, Stuart? Yeah, good performance, and a really critical goal to give them the lead. They just couldn't cope with his movement today.